Hi, this is Eddie Deason. You're listening to Breaking the Fourth Wall. I was Mandark in Dexter's laboratory. Ha 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 ha. Hey, what's up, guys? Christopher Stolle for Breaking the Fourth Wall Entertainment. Uh, this is uh, not your typical uh, Breaking the Fourth Wall podcast, uh, obviously, because first off, I'm by myself. But this is breaking news out of Wisconsin, uh, where, unfortunately, a Christmas parade that was going on uh, consisting of different members of, like, different schools doing, like, marching bands and everything else, a red SUV plowed through the uh through the uh, parade we don't have much in the way of details i do have this footage here that i will be sharing right now uh of what's going on this was a cell phone coverage of the uh, parade as you can see people are marching and everything else and here comes the red suv out of nowhere just slamming in the people uh, from news reports that we've gotten so far during this, there was also gunfire. It is unclear whether that was coming from the vehicle or if that was coming from police or if that was coming from bystanders trying to stop the vehicle. That much is unclear. Also, it is unclear uh, about the driver itself or his motivations uh, to this. We will report this as more and more information is available. Uh, Quite honestly, after the heels of the Kyle Rittenhouse case, uh, I would not be surprised if it ties into uh, the unrest about the uh, the verdict. But again, here at Breaking the Fourth Wall Entertainment, we're not going to uh, jump to any conclusions whatsoever until more details are released. Uh, right now, we just know that something about 14, uh, 11 to 15 people injured. I don't know about fatalities, and I don't know about the motivations of this. The only thing I can give on a personal level is this is, regardless of the reasonings, this is just, this is terrible. This is disgusting. This is not anything you ever want to see, especially so, so close to the holidays, but ever, you know, especially involving children. So stay with us. We will give you more details as we find it and bring it to you, and we will more than likely have a panel on this uh, as the information is released. Until then, our, here at Breaking the Fourth Wall Entertainment, our hearts and our thoughts and our prayers go out to the victims and their families in this time.